accusations of sexual harassment against the longtime superintendent of schools in Everett from a former clerk. WBZ's Christina Rex spoke with the woman making those claims and with the superintendent himself. I feel like I was laid off because I wouldn't do what he asked and I wouldn't allow him to do what he wanted. Andrea Garay says she was subject to more than a year of sexual harassment and discrimination in her time as a clerk at the Everett superintendent's office. It was like a new toy in the building. It was very weird. She says she faced repeated unwanted advances from her boss, the superintendent of nearly 30 years, Fred Forrestair. In a two-page complaint filed at the Massachusetts Commission Against Discrimination, Gray says he would touch her behind as he walked by and claims he would often ask what color undergarments she was wearing. Well, what color underwear do you have on for my birthday? And he asked me to turn around and I did it like I turned around like I didn't know like I was so scared like I didn't know what to do he said oh, lift, lift your skirt I couldn't both the school department and the school committee are aware of these allegations and say they plan to cooperate with the state investigation how nice to see you superintendent Fred Forrester is still on the job and denies the accusations you deny everything that's in that report that's correct absolutely nothing like that's ever happened Ever. We have to go its course. It's oh, been course, referred to the, uh, to the MCAD, right? Mm -hmm. And we'll let that work through its process. In a statement to WBZ, the school committee chair wrote, quote, During his career as superintendent, over 1,000 employees have left school department employment, and not one single complaint has been made about the superintendent. You said, you know, you want more people to come forward. Obviously, you're the first person who has taken the steps to put this on paper. Why? I don't care how powerful someone is. Like, it's not okay. And it's not a secret. The Everett mayor released a statement to WBZ saying he takes these allegations very seriously. He says he trusts that MCAD will do a timely and thorough investigation. In Everett, Christina Rex, WBZ News. Christina, thank you.